welcome back to my channel and in today's video as you can tell by the title i'm going to be taking you through my new year morning routine so obviously it's like towards the end of january so this is the routine i've been doing pretty much every day for the whole month of january and i thought i would show you guys today so make sure you go ahead and subscribe to my channel and let's go ahead and get started okay so the first thing i do in the morning is i come into the bathroom and I put something on my skin, I brush my hair and my teeth and put my contacts in, but I already did that. So um, I think I've mentioned in another video, I've been like working out in the morning, so I don't like to do my full skincare routine right away, but I do need something on my face because it's so dry. So I've just been spraying on this Sunita's Moisture Mist and it just kind of helps add some hydration back um, before I am able to do my skincare. So I just put some of that on for now and brush my hair. All right. And then I'm just gonna go ahead and brush my teeth. And then I just put on my little lip mask. This is the I Do Care buttery vitamin C lip mask. I've had this forever. It's honestly probably expired. Okay, all done in the bathroom. Now it's coffee time. Okay, so today um, I didn't get up as early because one, I wanted to film this when it, the lighting was better outside, but it's like actually rainy, so that wouldn't have even mattered. Um, but I usually get up between 6 and 7 with Brad because he um, is a teacher, so he has to get up early for school, and usually I would just get up with him. But today, like I said, I wanted to wait, and I just wanted some more sleep because I didn't sleep very good last night. Um, so I did sleep in, but he already made the coffee is what I'm trying to say. Jeez, I need this to like get my brain going. Um, and I'm going to use this cup. Look how cute it is. Brad's brother and... His girlfriend got this for me for Christmas and it's so cute. I love it. So um, I'm gonna go ahead and make my coffee. You guys know I do ice. And then the cinnamon. This goes in before anything because if it goes in on top, then it's impossible to mix in. So I do like a generous amount of cinnamon, like enough to choke you basically. <laughs> and then we add in our coffee. I'm just gonna use the rest. And then we're out of my favorite creamer. Let me show you, it's still in the recycling. Right here, we're out and it's the Nat Natural Bliss Oat Milk creamer and brown sugar and it is so good I need to run and get some more of this but we're out so I'm using my backup one which is like my old favorite the one I loved before this one and it's still really good so I like to sometimes throw this in there anyways so do some of this and this one is the silk almond creamer it's sweet and creamy so like sweet cream that might have been too much it is what it is I'm done. We go. Okay, now we head into the couch. Okay, so I have my coffee, and after I make my coffee, I always come out to the couch, and I spend quite a bit of time out here. Um, I don't let myself turn on the TV at all. So what I do is I write in all my journals, which I'll show you. I read a chapter of a book and I meditate. So I told you I have like a bunch of journals and stuff that I write in. This is my book that I'm reading, but I have my planner, my artist of life workbook, and then my actual journal. And the first thing I grab is my actual journal. And what I do is I write five to seven things that I'm grateful for. And then I write what is called my morning menu. So I do that every morning. I heard this on like a podcast. 
I don't think it's called the morning menu. I just have been writing that in my journal because I think it sounds cute. And what it is, is you do a movement, a mindfulness, and a mastery task. So movement doesn't necessarily have to be like working out or anything like that. Like for example, my movement this morning that I will write down that I already did was my skincare and like my hair care and all that and making coffee. So that's like getting up, moving, and I did already make my bed. So that could be um, an example of like a movement. Um, I am gonna work out today, but it's gonna be separate from like this. So I usually just count like my skincare, making my coffee or making my bed as my movement. And I try to do the movement the first, first thing that I do. So that's the first thing. Second thing is mindfulness. So mindfulness would be journaling, it would be meditating. So I have two mindfulness tasks and you only need to have one of each of these tasks. I just prefer to pick like two or three. And then mastery is my book. So I'm reading a book. So that would be um, my mastery task for the morning. And the book I'm reading is, I just finished the four agreements and now I'm reading the fifth agreement. So I'm really excited to start this one. It's a new week, so I started a new book. I've tried to read one to two books a week. So yeah, that's my journal and my book. And then after I do that journal, before I start reading, I fill in my habit tracker right here. So um, I've showed, I showed this in my um, favorites video. I'll put it up here um, with a timestamp where I talk about this if you are like super interested. But basically it's just like my yearly plan um, and my monthly plan. And I just like go in and fill out my habit tracker. Um, so my habits that I have on here are meditate, wake up at 6 a.m., which I only um, require myself to do that four days a week. So this is one of my days that I didn't. Um, read, journal, one gallon of water, which I am not doing very good at that. Um, anyways, and then my skincare, workout, and then stretching. So I fill in my habit tracker and that's it for this. And then I go into my daily planner and I actually think I already filled this out for today. Yeah, I did. So I'll just need to fill in like my win from today at the end, but I just have like how I want to feel today, what I want to focus on, my important tasks, and then my self-care tasks, which is like my whole morning. So like meditating, journaling, working out, um, and reading. So after I fill all that in, I will read a chapter, like I said. Oh, hello. Good morning. Um, and then I will meditate for anywhere from five to 20 minutes, just depending on how much time I have. Today, I'll probably do like a 10 minute or 15 minute one. And yeah, let's just go ahead and get started. I'll just prop you guys up, speed it up, and you guys can watch me do my little morning stuff. Is there something after there's nothing to say? Just moving in circles, but we're losing our shape I'm like so I always
always love doing um, boho beautiful meditations. She's just like so calming and I love her. So after that, I usually, if you know me, you know I'm not like a huge breakfast person, but I notice throughout the day, especially when I'm like working, that I like forget to eat. So I've really been trying to make a point to eat something for breakfast. Um, and my favorite go-to has been just having a smoothie because it's like I'm just drinking something, but it's actually filling me up and giving me like the nutrients that I need. So I'm gonna go ahead and make my smoothie. And the first thing I put in is spinach. I just put like a heaping handful of spinach in. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. So a little blender, I put like this much spinach like a whole salad basically. <laughs> and then I put in almond milk and half a can of pineapple juice. And I like to go ahead and blend this first because I noticed that if I just like put everything in there and blend it all together, the spinach doesn't like grind up as much. So I'm gonna go ahead and put in some almond milk, just like a splash or two. I like my smoothies to be pretty runny. I don't like it to be like thick. So I don't put like ice in it or anything. And then just, I used half of this yesterday. So I'll just use the other half today. And it just gives it a little bit of sweetness and it helps with the spinach. So I'm gonna go ahead and blend this up really quick. All right, so you can see it's pretty like liquidy. It's blended up for the most part. There's still like some chunks on the side, but as we blend, it'll get better. And then the next thing I add is a banana, just one whole banana. And I like when they're really, really ripe like this because it makes it sweeter. And then I add two kinds of frozen fruit. So I have um, frozen pineapple, Oh my God, that's way too much. Okay, then I'm just gonna use pineapple. Usually I would put some of this in too, but I'm just gonna be a pineapple smoothie today. <laughs> and then I will also put in some chia seeds, just organic chia seeds for fiber and all that kind of stuff. And I'll just take like a spoon, and just do like a spoonful. And the next thing is like, I feel like what holds the whole smoothie together, what brings it to life, and that is this Teamy Greens Superfood Blend. I've been using this in my smoothies every day for a couple weeks now, and I seriously love it so much. One, it has like a daily dose of greens, which like I said, I always like forget to eat lunch if I'm super busy. And the spinach in here is great, but this just ensures that you hit that daily goal of greens. And I love that it is, there are 16 superfood ingredients. It's 100% plant-based and vegan, GMO-free, gluten-free, dairy, and soy-free. So if you are allergic to any of those things or you um, like are plant-based, this is totally safe for you to use. And I love that all the ingredients on here, like I know what they are. So I just love that on the ingredients, you can clearly see what's in here. Because of like the matcha and everything, it does have a little bit of caffeine. And you know me, I like, drink so much coffee so it's nice that this has some caffeine so i can kind of cut back on my coffee intake that way i'm not using like as much creamer and all of that kind of stuff so i really have been loving this it doesn't really have much of a taste to it it's just like a nice earthy matcha taste and i honestly like don't even notice it in my smoothie so i just take the scoop and just do one full scoop in my smoothie and I've been loving this so much. So if you guys want to try it, I do have a discount code for you that you can use to get yourself some of this. And Teamy is like a really great brand. I've used some of their skincare products before. Um, they have like a ton of awesome, healthy products. So go check them out if you haven't already. But I'm going to go ahead and blend this up. Okay, so it's all ready to go. Not just my nails. <laughs> um, and then I'm just going to put it in my little teeny tumbler, which is nice. You can just like take this wherever. So 
So yeah, this is my breakfast. This is what I have every morning. So if I have somewhere to be, I'll take this to go. But if I'm gonna be at home, then I will just take this over to the couch. I'll let myself be on my phone for the first time. And I will watch a YouTube video while I drink this. And then I'll be getting ready to do my workout. So I'm gonna go ahead and drink this, watch like one YouTube video, and then get rolling with my workout. Okay, see you in a minute. off that is pretty much my morning routine now i'm just gonna get started with my day do some work on my computer and run any errands i need to run so thank you guys so much for watching let me know down in the comments what videos you want to see for february and i will see you guys in my next video bye